Hello, my name is Duncan. I'm a network engineer at IT for Automation. Today I'm going to demonstrate Moxus MX Config. Moxus MX Config is a comprehensive Windows based utility that is used to install, configure, and maintain multiple Moxus devices in industrial networks. This suite of useful tools helps users set the IP addresses of multiple devices with one click, configure the redundant protocols and VLAN settings modify multiple network configurations of multiple MOXA devices, upload firmware to multiple devices, export, import configuration files, copy configuration settings across devices, easily link to web and telnet consoles, and test device connectivity. MOXA MX Config gives device installers and control engineers a powerful and easy way to mass configure devices and effectively reduces the setup and maintenance costs. In this demonstration, I'm going to use Moxa MX Config to configure IP addresses on multiple Moxa devices. Hope you enjoy the video. Thank you. Now I'm going to show you where to download Moxa MX Config. Open your web browser, go to www.moxa.com support and downloads, firmware, drivers, documents. Use the drop down to select your Moxa switch. and then choose software packages. You can download MX config. You can also select your operating system. Get the correct download and a free registration is required to become a Moxa member and give access to the download. Now I'm going to show you the installation of MX Config. I've downloaded the, the file to the desktop, so I open that and then I run the MX Config setup file. Choose your, choose your language and click OK. And then click on Next to start the wizard. Choose your destination and uh, start menu folder and choose if you'd like to create a desktop icon or not then click next and click install then click finish and then you can see the MX config icon on the desktop. This is the app setup for this demonstration. I have three Moxa ICS G7852A switches and three Moxa IKS 6728-8POE switches. The switches have an IP address of 192.168.127.253 which is the default and the Moxa MX Config PC has an IP address of 192.168.18.100 and uh, I've connected the PC to one switch and then um, each switch to the next switch so they're all connected. This is the physical lab setup. You can see at the top I have the three Moxa ICS switches and then at the bottom I have the three Moxa IKS switches and each switch is connected to the next switch.
Now I'm going to show you how to use Moxer MX config to configure an IP address on multiple Moxer devices. So open up MX config. This is the login window. The user is admin and the password is Moxer in lowercase letters. Then click login. This is the main Moxer MX config window. Click the broadcast search button and in this case we're using industrial ethernet switches so just leave that box selected and then click search the search has finished we we'll click the close button and we can see here it's found this, the six switches that we're using the three ICS G7852A 4XG switches have been found and the three IKS 67288POE 4G TXSFB-T switches have been found. So the these switches here, the ICS switches, have a password configured by default. So we need to unlock them. This is the lock symbol, which means that you can't make any configuration changes using MX config while the switch is locked. So to unlock, select the switches, right click, and choose unlock device, then enter the password, which is Moxer in lowercase letters, and then click unlock, and then OK. The switches have been unlocked successfully. So click OK and then close. The IKS switches by default have a password which is blank with the current firmware that we're using. So these are version 4.1 and this is 3.5. So to make IP address changes on the switches, select all the switches and uh, click the network setting box. So at the moment you can see all switches have the default IP address of 192.168.127.253 I'd like the switches to start at 192.168.18.50 So I click static, choose IP and then start from 192.168.18.50 an increment of 1 and click generate so the IP addresses have been allocated from 192.168.18.50 all the way to 192.168.18.55 and you can choose the order um, using this box if you'd like to allocate them in a different order the net mask I'd like to be 255.255.255.0 and the gateway and DNS settings are fine for my setup. Click configure and just confirm that this looks OK. Then click OK. One by one, the switches are being modified successfully. OK, they've all been uh, modified successfully, click OK and then click close. So I'll do another broadcast search again and I'll just select the industrial ethernet switches, click search. Then close and that's it. The uh, switches have been configured with new IP addresses. Thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you'd like any further information about products, project engineering services or training, please use these contact details. Thank you.